hi guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video I'm going to um, introduce the makeup slash product for traveling essential let's get to the video okay so before I start uh, I'm sorry that I've not been posting a lot because I've been busy lately with work and I do have a daily job and yes, I'm quite busy lately and today I had free time because I was sick because of like my stomach is cramping, you know, and vomiting but after all the medication it calmed down a little bit so I'm able to at least sit down and do this video with you guys. So let's get started with the first product. So the first product is my primer. As per usual, I only have one type of primer, but I have two scent, which is one is blueberry and what's this? Apple acid. And this I bought it at the I bought it uh, on the item where, where I'm selling. I bought it from the uh, main person that sell this thing. I'm just helping her out. So this is one of them. This is only for traveling yeah and secondly i do have my avino uh, moisturizer daily moisturizing lotion it looks dirty because it's in a makeup bag and all the makeup got everywhere so it's pretty dirty here and i got this for two dollars this is also a travel size and as you guys know that avino is quite expensive quite but not very expensive so i bought the travel size to test it out and so far i liked it so i'm still gonna keep this for traveling all right so next um foundation it's not clinic foundation it is the brand but it's not the clinic foundation it's just my own foundation that i put in here because i do not want to bring like a big bottle because anyways when i'm traveling or oh, nowadays i don't even use that much um i don't even use that much foundation because my skin really need to breathe okay so next we have compact powder this is nrc this is from malaysia um yeah so it's a compact powder and what what color is this cinnamon this is cinnamon color and so far i really i really like this color i mean this product and i also do have um i bought i just recently did i bought this no i got it for free from the seller that i'm helping out for selling the products i got this for free and this is the green tea pressed powder and this is the number six yeah and this was quite good it's very it's light coverage but it makes your skin feels very nice and we're gonna move on to the next one beauty blenders yes i have one big one and one small one it looks very nasty and yes i do agree it looks very nasty here because the stain is like um, saturated deeply in the beauty blender that I couldn't really like wash it nicely so it still be like this or just a teeny bit lighter so yes this too this is for my under eye and my eyes area this is for the rest of my face okay so next is brow soap I recently bought this and I've been loving this for like quite a lot you know and it came with a little brush uh, that I used a lot it's a dirty the brush yeah so it came with a little uh, it came with a little brush and this it's like a small compact tiny I just slide it and you just uh, put a little bit water and then rub this in here and then put it on your brow I I've not been using this nowadays cause I'm quite busy lately and you know 
so I, I I have no time to use makeup and all. What I would use is this mascara and my brows, maybe. Yeah, just like that. Okay. And next, eyeshadow. Uh, it, it it's kind of a little bit dark because it's gonna start raining soon. So the eyeshadow I've talked about this a lot, and it's the. Zoeva Caramel Malengi 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 Eyeshadow Palette This is the mini version The mini version already cost like $25 And the large Big version basically about $50 plus If I'm not mistaken Or $40 So here's the mini version I either bring this or the Huda Beauty But most of the time Nowadays I bring this Because this has a good pigmentation And the color range Is quite nice and I love all these shimmers. This is a good option. If you couldn't afford the... I mean, not I say, not like couldn't afford, but if you just want to test out like Zoeva palettes, buy the mini version if you could find the mini version. And test it out. If you love it, finish it up and you like it, buy a bigger version of it. A large, a large uh, full version of it maybe. Okay, so next one is mascara, and this is Your Glam Long Mascara, and this is from Daiso, and this is so far um, the best product product at Daiso that I've got, and I'm really impressed with this. I bought the long and volume uh, mascara, volumized and long. And like, I mean, it it, it 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 doesn't smell that much, you know. Like it doesn't smell very chemically. So like, yes, and this is two dollars only. You know, I really give that a big thumbs up because it's just two dollars. And um, nextly, we're gonna move on to the blush. And this is also Daiso blush. And what I like about this blush is it's pigmented when you build it up. So if you don't build it up, it's not pigmented. But if you want to be it like that, then be it, you know. It's quite bright. Let me let me swatch at my oh you hear that? Let me swatch at my lightest part of my skin. It's quite pigmented though. Like it turns out in my skin, but anyway, so and yes, and we have lash curler, yeah, these mini lash curlers. And I got this, it's like a dollar stores or something. The band here is not as thick as this type of bands, you know. Like this is very thick and squishy and this is like you reach the bottom here and you still see there's a little gap. I don't know but I just can see a little gap there. And I need to squeeze harder, you know, till these scissors touch each other. Look, it's touching each other. So but still this still works as good as how normal lash color work. Next, we have brow products. Oh my god, it's getting very dark. So this bottom part is the gel. And the gel is very soft compared to a pomade. Like Anastasia pomade. Let me... Let me find it if I could. No, I just couldn't find it. So like this gel is quite soft. So you have to work a little bit with a small amount. And this top part here is... A powder so after you put a gel you can put the powder on oh, cannot really see <laughs> I didn't do a really good swatch it's a little grayish but I don't mind because the powder is really I mean the gel is already quite dark so I just use the powder to powder down a little bit so it doesn't look waxy so we're gonna move on very fast here because it's getting really dark here and Okay, so let's move on to... Okay, so we have this brush. It came with this brush. And good thing is it came with this. 
So it have a spoolie but a tiny version here and a angle brush. Tiny version. And we have highlight. I have two different types of highlight that I bring. This is more of a white highlight or something and this is a, a refill version actually this is an eyeshadow but it works as a highlight though and this is the becca highlight don't ask me why it looked like that because it broke and i fixed it i fixed it with like a um i fix it with a perfume so and compress it together and um, next we have my nail oil bring that along because as you guys know I'm doing a nail growth journey and we'll tell you guys in that next video I'm not sure when it's gonna be it might be a longer as uh, much more longer than what you guys expected so let's really move on really quick now because it's getting really dark here so I'm here I bought this Sunplay SPF 130 as well 130 SPF and I have this Bio Essence Bio White Tanaka plus Camellia um, Advanced Whitening Tone Cream if I didn't use any foundation at my neck I will put this and a powder on top and I have this acne patch a travel version I got it for free because I bought a lot of, a lot of acne brand and lastly we have last not really last the second last we have makeup wipes always bring that along or makeup remover or something and last we have the brush all these brushes and yes i do use all of them so good thing about that so yes so that's about it and it's really really dark right now and like you guys can't even see me that well so I'm going to see you guys in my next video on my nail growth journey. Bye!